For many years, mankind has gazed up at the evening sky with awe, trying to find answers to the questions of the universe. During the 20th century, scientists came up with the Big Bang Theory, an innovative hypothesis created to describe the beginning, growth, and development of the universe. Although the theory was accepted widely, it left some questions unanswered. In the last few years, new studies have complicated the cosmic mystery even further. In 2023, NASA's James Webb Space Telescope discovered a remarkable celestial body that seemed to be older than the universe itself. This staggering find perplexed experts, leading them to grapple with an unsettling dilemma. How can a star live for a greater length of time than the universe it is part of? Such a revelation has sparked debates about whether this discovery challenges our current understanding of the cosmos and whether it might even demand the creation of an entirely new model to explain the enigma. These are the mysteries we will explore in this video. If you want to keep up with discoveries about the universe and beyond, make sure to subscribe, like this video, and enable notifications. Approximately 200 light years from here, Near the constellation Libra is an old star that is formally listed as HD 140283. The reason this stellar object is so fascinating is not only because of its record-breaking speed of 44,283 kilometers an hour, but also because the speed provides hints about its violent history. Almost a billion years ago, in the earliest days of the formation of the Milky Way, this star crashed and merged with a dwarf galaxy, which is now presumed to have been its birthplace. But its speed is not the most astonishing aspect of it. Dubbed Methuselah after the biblical character said to have lived for 969 years, its age has been a cosmic mystery. Early estimates placed it at an astonishing 16 billion years old. Subsequent calculations modified this to 14.46 billion years, with an error of plus or minus 800 million years. Even with the lower figure, this puts the star's estimated age above the generally accepted age of the universe itself, which, according to observations of the cosmic microwave background radiation, is approximately 13.8 billion years. How is it possible for a star to be older than the universe? The paradox challenges scientists to make them wonder if our methods of dating are incorrect, or if our understanding of how old the universe is needs to be revised. It's not an easy process calculating the age of celestial bodies. Stars, including the Sun, can maintain stability in temperature and size for billions of years, making it difficult to ascertain their life expectancy. They use fine variations in brightness and color, and then match those changes with mathematical stellar evolution models. The second factor that's essential for estimating age is the rotation rate of a star. Just as a rotating will lose its speed over time due to friction, stars lose speed as well. By comparing the rates of rotation of stars at various stages of their lives, astronomers have established equations through a process known as gyrochronology that aid in estimating the ages of stars. Methuselah is still the oldest star in the universe for which we are able to make a fairly accurate determination of age. Instead of merely accepting that it existed before the cosmos itself, perhaps the key answer lies in reassessing our core assumptions. Is it possible the universe is older than scientists have long thought? The actual scale of 13.8 billion years is hard to get your head around. If you were to condense the universe's history into one year and the Big Bang going off like a brilliant New Year firework, Earth itself would not materialize until the end of December. Human society, with all of its history, would take up the last 10 seconds of December 31st. To figure the age of the universe, astronomers look at light coming from stars that took shape hundreds of millions of years after the Big Bang. When the universe expands, light from galaxies far away moves toward the red end of the spectrum. Through the observation of both this redshift and galaxy distances, astronomers have repeatedly measured the age of the universe to be roughly 13.8 billion years. But new research is casting doubt on this well-established estimate. 
physicists at the University of Ottawa, led by Professor Rajendra Gupta, proposed the cosmos could be much older, some 26.7 billion years. Gupta's theory revisits Swiss astronomer Fritz Zwicky's 1929 tired light theory and merges it with new concepts. In this theory, Protons lose energy over time as they move through immense distances of space and time. Although this defies conventional interpretations of redshift, Gupta suggests that redshift may be a hybrid effect, partly the result of universal expansion, partly due to energy loss due to aging. If true, this reinterpretation may significantly prolong the age of the universe and explain unsolved mysteries and even explain enigmatic observations newly observed by NASA. The James Webb Space Telescope has helped facilitate this potentiality of a 26.7 billion year old universe. Gupta's framework also utilizes the evolutionary interactions constant notion, originally proposed by theoretical physicist Paul Dirac, that basic forces themselves might have evolved through time. Remind yourself that the age of the universe has been repeatedly recalculated throughout history. To give a specific example, in the 1920s Edwin Hubble dated it at a paltry 2 billion years. As techniques and instruments became more sophisticated, so did our estimate, moving closer to the figure we accept today. Gupta's model is another huge step toward refining the cosmic chronology now. Whether the history of humankind equates to the last 10 seconds or even the last 5 seconds of this universal clock, there is one certainty, the universe is ancient beyond our imagination, full of wonders that continue to redefine what we believe we understand. In addition to these discoveries, fresh evidence in our own Milky Way adds still more mystery. Recent observations reveal that stars in the outer parts of our galaxy are moving much slower than they should be relative to stars in comparable outer parts of other galaxies. This peculiar response has caused astronomers to ponder two theories. One is that the Milky Way might possess less dark matter than had been thought. Dark matter even though invisible, is suspected to be responsible for much of the gravitational scaffolding that keeps galaxies in place. The alternative is even more extreme. Maybe our very conception of dark matter, how much of it there is, is wrong. These findings are based on observations made by the European Space Agency's Gaia satellite, which has charted the position and motion of almost 2 billion stars in our galaxy to unprecedented accuracy. By studying this information, astronomers have revised the Milky Way's total mass, stars, gas, dust, and dark matter to approximately 200,000 billion times the sun's mass. While this is a mind-boggling number, it still falls about five times below previous estimates. This is not to say visible matter has disappeared. More likely, it could mean the galaxy holds far less dark matter than previously estimated. Nonetheless, gauging the mass of a whole galaxy is a notoriously tough task, and the discrepancy could be due to uncertainty in Gaia's data or imperfections in the analysis techniques employed. Despite these questions, scientists will keep exploring these enigmas. The universe is big, ancient, and always surprising, and each bit of new information changes our picture of the universe. We'll keep you posted with the new news. If you like this journey, don't forget to like the video, subscribe to the channel, and wait for more amazing discoveries from the universe.